Hi everyone, today I'm going to be talking about how to use our BioRed cell counter. And so what I'm showing you right now in this tube is a mixture, oops, is a mixture of my cells that I am getting ready to count. This is all in the tissue culture hood. So I have my Epinerv tube, my Tripan blue, and my pipettes, and my slide counter. So these are specific for the BioRad cell counter. Um, and so you wanna make sure that you have those. You cannot use any old slide. Anyway, so what I'm gonna be doing is adding 10 microliters of my trypsinized cell mixture in an Eppendorf tube with 10 microliters of my Tricam Blue. So once I have those mixed together in this Eppendorf tube, I'm going to take 10 microliters, and I usually just use the same pipette tip. And then what you want to do is pipette it into the hemicytometer. There are two layers here, and it's a little bit hard to show, but that's what I'm going to be doing. And so you can see now that I've filled chamber B, with my cell mixture tripan blue solution. So now what I'm going to be doing is turning on the cell counter and letting that warm up. In the meantime, these are the cell counting dual chamber slides for this particular cell counter. And so when it comes up, it comes up with this menu where you can count cells and do all these different things. But honestly, all you really do is take the side, so again, this is side B with the tripan blue, and put it in there. And it automatically recognizes that there's tripan blue and cells there. And so it will focus and count your cells for you. So this takes a little bit of time, but when it's done, it'll come with your total count, your live count, your live cell percentage, your time and date, which is kind of nice. So then you can go through your histogram gating and see how it counted. It'll actually show you examples. Um, so if you have any questions about what it's actually doing, that's good. Um, you can view various images around the slide. But what's most useful, quite honestly, if you're happy with your percentage of live cells, which I am, is your dilution calculator. And so it automatically uses your starting live concentration because usually you want to plate live cells. And so for this experiment that I'm planning on doing, I need 5, 10 to the fourth cells. So it's a little push buttony where you have to push enter and then up and down, but you can tell it your final um, dilution and your final volume. And the really nice thing is that it tells you, okay, I need 1.3 mils of my cell sample and then I need to dilute it in 18.7 mils of buffer. And what this usually means is your cell culture media. And we do have a printer hooked up to this instrument. So it actually is really nice for record keeping to print out your dilution so you know how much you put in, if there's ever a question in your calculations or whatnot. And this is on a little sticky um, thing, so you can stick it right in your notebook.